Hi, I'm Paul from Paul's Fishing Systems and I'm here today to talk about our new winch. This is a powerful winch. It's got a 230 watt motor, it's got a very robust cast spool on it and it's on a 5mm frame. This winch is ideal for pulling in big kite rigs, contickies, doesn't matter how much weed you've got, sharks or whatever, this winch will pull it in. You might be wondering where the motor is. Well, we've put the motor inside the drum. That keeps it out of the way of getting sand or water spray in it. And this is it. The gearbox is a planetary gearbox, which is the most efficient gearbox that you can have. We've got nylon rollers all around the perimeter. And inside the drum, we've got a nylon bush. This rubber seal stops any sand or water spray getting inside. And if any water does get in, it will just drain out of the bottom. It's really easy to change spools. Really easy to take it apart, put it together. If you're going to run it out, you just have that pin. That's the freewheel position. And this pin locks it in place, ready to haul. Just pop it in like that. If you run the battery flat, you just remove this pin, replace it with the handle and that allows you to easily recover the gear in the case of uh, a flat battery. This part's the ratchet. If you're a kite fisherman and you want to stop the gear anywhere that's not quite full distance out, just lock it in place like that. That'll hold a solid. For recovery it's got a two position switch, one for just hauling in the line from a long distance out. The second, if you're using a conventional Contiki long line or a coat long line, it's got a pulse switch so that you can just pulse between traces. For those that have a sure thing, the two long bolts that are left on the winch frame are for putting your uh, hook section recovery post on. Just pops on there really easily. And before you know it, you're ready to put your hook section back on. This rail's got 2,000 metres of 100 kg line on it. It's got a really small footprint, as you can see. It's the most compact winch on the market. So it's the most powerful and it's the smallest. And it's just so easy to strip apart. If you've got two rigs and you want to change reels, nothing could be easier. Beautiful system of rollers. We've connected this ammeter to show how electrically efficient this rig is. Most of the other winches have about 150 watt motors. And really, that's just not enough, particularly if you're kite fishing or you've got a whole pile of weed. What happens is the motors heat up, they become less and less efficient and before you know it you've burnt the motor out or blown the fuse. So when this is in the on position it draws very little, about the same as a normal winch. As it starts getting under load it builds up a lot more slowly than a 150 watt motor. That would be an extreme load, I'm grabbing the sides of the reels here about as hard as I can. I don't think I could stall it and as you can see, the amp draw is minimal. Do that with a 150 watt motor and you'll see it surging possibly as high as 40 amps. This is a really efficient rig.